It's your boy Moody Star. I'm back again with another video. Yo, listen, I know I ain't dropped a video in uh, a couple of days. You know, I've been working a lot and uh, I'm also traveling this weekend. You feel me? So I'm just cooling in Florida, vibing. You know, I just finally needed a break, bro. You know what I'm saying? From time to time, when you in the Matrix, dog, like you definitely gotta uh, have some quote unquote vacation time. Especially if you've been working. Uh, you know, you've been saving your money and stuff like, you know, make sure when you are working, you uh, put some money aside for yourself um, so you can, you know, just enjoy life. You feel me? Travel, uh, you know, get out, you know what I'm saying? Instead of doing the same thing over and over and over and over again, you know what I'm saying? It get, it get a little crazy, you know, so... But for the most part, though, uh, I'm cooling, I'm ch chilling, uh... A lot of things are, again, like, there's been so much change going on, like, this month. Like, even coming up in the near future, there's going to be a lot more changes for me. Um, as far as, like, just me um, finally getting to my goals and stuff like that. Uh, different new goals that I have set this month. So, you know, I planted my seeds and like, I say within three weeks, you feel me? Whatever I did three weeks ago, like, I'm finally starting to see the work for that. So... I'm very appreciative of that. Um, and if you've been doing the same or, you know, something similar, you should really be appreciative of that, of yourself, you feel me? Because you are putting in the work. Like, you're doing the work that nobody sees. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody just sees, like, you know, the end picture, you feel me? They just see the car or they just see the girl or they just see the house. You know what I'm saying? They don't even understand what the shadow work is, you know? That's what's more more important. Getting the shadow work done, you know, having the foundation done, like as far as your spiritual journey, as far as like day to day life, you're living in the matrix, doing what you got to do, whether it's work, school, you know, whatever situation that you may be in, you know. So. Like with me. Um, yeah, I'm, a, I'm on that type of time where I, I have to have more faith in uh my unseen energy uh my internal world um we have to be very careful of how we put out our energy in the matrix is very important uh we don't want to get shortchanged um when you talk about whether it's working as far as like with different corporations you could be putting out so much energy and getting paid pennies you know what i'm saying getting paid a penny for your thought you know, if you, even if you're an artist or something like that, you know, so for me, I'm at that point where I know I can survive. I know I can function in the matrix. There was once upon a time where, you know, I was going through different situations. Um, I had to go to the hospital and, you know what I'm saying? I had mental, uh, breakdowns and stuff like this is like early 20s and shit you feel me um and i always wondered like damn can i even function in the matrix can i function without my parents can i function you know can i be self-sufficient you know what i'm saying while still keeping my mind while still staying sane in this crazy world you know what i'm saying and shit i don't know how i do it sometimes you feel me when you be doing shit, sometimes you don't even know how you figure things out, but you do because you have that unseen energy within you. I can't even fully explain it, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it does things that we don't even know that we're aware of doing. You feel me? Like your unseen energy can provide, you know, a way of life where you are safe and you're secure. But you're still disciplined and you're still working hard and you're still alert. Bro, the spiritual realm is real. So that's why, you know, I just be cooling. Taking my time, bro. But uh, as far as just the journey overall, you know, I'm just, uh, again, appreciative of being able to just be alive, be, be present. Um, be healthy and yeah for the most part that's what it is though
as far as my retention journey, like I said, two weeks, no, nah, not two weeks, it, it's been about three weeks of the same shit that's been going on, like, you know what I'm saying, like, history sometimes repeats itself, um, when it comes to, like, the different, uh, battles one is, one goes through, I can speak for myself, you know what I'm saying, I don't know about y'all, it might be different for y'all, you know, but, outside of that, yeah, I'm just cooling. Uh, I'm really excited for this, uh, what, what are we going into? November? I'm going into November. It's going to be lit. I think I'm going to end October with a bang. Uh, oh, by the way, I actually appreciate all the new subscribers, bro. Like, y'all been going crazy. I don't know if y'all been sharing the videos or whatnot, but, you know, I appreciate that. Uh, I appreciate all the new, uh, people coming through. If y'all can resonate with one of my videos, I appreciate that. Because uh, sometimes, you know, more, more, every time when I do these videos, it's not, I mean, unless I'm going live or whatnot, every time when I'm doing these videos, these are like just open thoughts. That's why sometimes I like to title my videos MGT Quick Thoughts. You know what I'm saying? Because the thoughts becoming like quick, basically. Uh, and based on just my overall look on my journey in my life and how to deal with the matrix is everybody's dealing with the matrix everybody's dealing with bills everybody's dealing with dealing with the job that you know they ask so much of you and they only pay you so much you know we all deal with them jobs that are supposed to pay you a certain rate and they don't they say oh yeah like you know you're you have this new position like you have this new title but the pay rate ain't changed. Like, nah, we got to do something about that. Nah, I got to wait until the next pay period for y'all to pay me to make up for this shit. I know y'all been through that shit before. I know I have. It's just very, very annoying. But I can tell you one thing, though. Uh, as long as you're consistent, you stay on the grind. Uh, make sure, like I said, you take some time out to yourself. You put some money aside. You go, cause right now I'm in Zen mode. I, I really, I'm really just cooling. Like I said that probably about like five times so far in this video, and shit, it's really not gonna be too long for real. Like I needed this time to just finally uh, relax. Crazy story, bro. Uh, crazy story. I don't know if I want to get into it. I probably might wait. Yeah, I probably, I'm probably, gonna, I'm, I'm gonna wait to like bring that up, cause I'm not saying that the story isn't over, but I just, you know, yeah. Anyway, what did happen as a recent, uh, I was able to, cause I think was it yesterday? Yesterday was the first day that I had like off in like a long ass time, so. I had some time to go out into, you know, social settings, and I went to, like, a little, it's a little, little hookah bar, but I ain't get shit, I literally just walked through that motherfucker, you know, just to see what the vibe was like, but I ain't get shit, uh, uh I went to the mall, going to the mall is fun, it was definitely going to the mall in Atlanta is fun as hell, it's funny, it's fun and it's funny, and the reason why I say it's funny, because you got people at different, you know, sections selling their shit and whatnot. And people are so aggressive, bro. When you look like, see, that's what I'm saying. When you when you got that life force energy and you out in public, bro, and you look like you somebody, you look like you going somewhere, you you look like you got money, basically. Bro, the motherfuckers be looking thirsty as hell. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Like, I have no problems rejecting people if I have to reject or if I have to turn down. Hey, man, I got this for you. Hey, you should check this out or whatnot. Sometimes motherfuckers be because me, I have such a like open, welcome spirit. Like I ain't I, the thing is, I'm not, it's like I'm friendly, but I'm not friendly. You feel me? It's like I don't want to be friendly with everybody. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, this shit, this shit's funny how like I have to handle those type of people. Not people, but, like, those ty types of situations when I'm out. Because, literally, if I go to the mall, nigga, I know what I want. Like, I ain't trying to get sold on anything else. Like, I know that, like, what I'm looking for. Uh, sometimes, maybe here and there, like, okay, if it's something that I ain't think about, 
you know, I'll probably grab this or grab that. But other than that, like, I ain't interested in really too much stuff in the Matrix like that. You know what I'm saying? So, but it was an interesting experience going to the mall in Atlanta. Straight. I didn't go to Lenox Mall, okay? That's not, I ain't, I went to one of the malls, like, basically in South Atlanta. Uh, really, technically, it's not. The hell? Forgot. Got my hair like that. But, uh, yeah, bro, like I said, man, this is just an update. I'm just tapping in with you guys. Uh, you know, like I said, I ain't dropped a video in two days. I've been traveling and been working and shit. And coming up on this week, uh, I'm beginning into some topics, you feel me? Some more about retention, of course. But I'm also going to be talk- talking about, like, some things going on in the Matrix. My thoughts on that. Uh, and how we should, like, you know, kind of govern our mental when we are going through the matrix and holding on to our life force energy. Um, but yeah, other than that, man, like I said, bro, uh, you know, stay with that loud pack. You know what I'm saying? Hit different when you know what you got, especially when you're on vacation and you vibing. You know, uh, stay safe, of course, and stay consistent, bro. Stay consistent. Um, whatever you believe in, if you gotta stay prayed up, whatever it is, you know, do what you gotta do. And, um, yeah, shit. I don't really have much more to say. Did I say? I, I didn't even do my uh, intro. MGT, what to do? It's your boy Moody Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do. Maybe become a subscriber, like the video, and join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk in. It's beautiful, fucked up, sideways ass matrix. Now, first of all, I gotta say, special shout out to anybody that's holding on to your energy, going within, and being high vibrational. Here at MGT, this is what we do. We work on ourselves every single day. Intro for the outro. I'm definitely see you guys on the next video, bro. Peace.